It's a win-win for the men that come in here to get the help that they need. It's a win for the families that have been destroyed. Faith Home Teen Ranch in Ceres is home for adults working for a second chance at life. They may have come in incarcerated or homeless or maybe a very successful career and some tragedy happened in their life and they started to abuse alcohol or, or drugs. But now these folks will give a second chance to others by helping to build them tiny homes. This site offers teachings in agriculture and beekeeping among others. It was recently approved to include construction in their vocational trainings and they are now to join the list of organizations in building tiny homes throughout the state for the homeless, ag workers and struggling families. So these homes that we will be building, they're modular homes, they'll be 400, 600 and 800 square feet. Four of the first homes are already in progress at Free Will Baptist Church in Modesto. Now that I'm seeing it and I know what's the cost, you know, what's the what's the meaning behind building these, like it gives me more joy. Built by people who understand the struggle. Some of my workers, they used to be in rehab home, and I've worked with them, and and they were homeless, and now I see them, you know, working. While agencies are coming together to determine construction funding at Faith Home, could be some state, some federal, some local funding that's coming in to help build them here because we want to keep the price down. Their goal is to build as many as they can to change as many lives as possible. It's just a win all the way around. The homeless, transitional housing, agricultural working, trades that people are learning to do. Construction at Faith Home is set to begin in the next three months. In series, Josie Hart, KCRA 3 News. Faith Home Teen Challenge says that their goal is to build four homes every month. Contractors in Modesto say that new modular homes are also expected to be built in Riverbank soon.